So here's the way that I'm implementing technology into my math classes. I went to my Google Drive and I made Google Slides for my students to um, collaborate with me on. So I'm going to upload it to my Google Classroom. So here's my homeroom. I'm going to go to Classwork, Create, Assignment, and then 2D and 3D Shapes. I'm going to go over here, go to my, my, Google, my Google Drive, and I'm going to upload my presentation. Now here you have the option of putting um, only to where your students can view it. They can't edit the slides. But you also have the options to where students can edit the file or that you can make a copy for each student. That is my goal is to make a copy for each student. But since this, this is one of the first um, times we've done this, we're still going to go with students can edit the file. So it's just one file that we're working on all together. So I'm going to assign. So here it is down here. So I'm going to click on that. I'm going to scroll down. And then there is my presentation. So they're going to click on it. And so all of my students have their Chromebooks. And this presentation is on their Chromebook. And so they're going to be working with me to do this. So we're all going to click over here. And it says, what is the difference between 2D and 3D shapes? They, at their desks, with their Chromebooks, they're going to draw a text box. And they're going to write what the difference is, what they think the difference is. So I'll be able to see it, and everybody in the class will be able to see it. So if we go to the second slide, um, again, here we can do it together. Or I can ask one person to go on to quadrilaterals and ask them to type in the definition and so it'll populate to all the computers. This one, interesting, that's not working. All right, so here are the shapes and if I call on a student one by one, they can move their the shape to their um, name or um, kids can do it like at their desks. Quadrilateral or not quadrilateral here, um, they're flipping along the slides with me at their computer. And so they can drag the objects to quadrilateral or not quadrilateral. And I would ask them some more defined questions of why is that not a quadrilateral or why is that a quadrilateral. So they're interacting with me using their Chromebooks. And I'm going to have this on my smart board so that they can see what's happening around the room. Anyhow, this is one of the things that I'm going to do in a couple of weeks. Um, I'm going to plan on doing more of this. They're still going to have their journal work, but I also want to have that technology piece with it. So, anyhow.